If you're doing any type of filming or photography and weather is a factor, you need to do this with all of your clients. Stay tuned. Welcome to Flash Film Academy. My name is Ty Turner. I'm a creative director here at Flash Film Media and a former Army combat photographer. And if this is your first time watching one of our videos, this channel is designed to help people like yourself turn your passion into profit. We like to use the term contentpreneurs. So make sure you hit that thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, click that notification bell so that you can be notified on our latest videos and let's get to it. Anytime you're filming or photographing anything outdoors, you want to always provide two backup dates and one backup location in your proposal. You never know what may happen. It may be more than just rain. You may get somewhere and it's too windy. You may get to a location and it's too much construction to capture audio. You always want to have a backup plan. You don't want to lose time or a shoot because you didn't plan for an alternative solution to a problem you didn't see coming. In this industry, preparation is everything. So if you provide that in the proposal, right when you list the steps and things you plan on doing, it makes you seem like you have your stuff together. It really shows that you've done this before and it makes the client at ease with spending the money. It adds value to what you offer and it can save your butt, cover your butt. So you wanna make sure you have that ready to go in the initial proposal. If you're going to location scout, you always want two locations, a primary location and a backup location, a primary date and two backup dates. That way things can run smooth and you don't miss money because you couldn't pick a good second date. When you're working with clients that may deal with someone traveling, they need to know these things in advance. So this really helps you out. All right, guys, if you have any questions about this, make sure you post them in the comments below. And if you learned anything today, I'm gonna ask you to do what I always ask you to do. Let's hit that thumbs up button. Let's hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, um, and stay tuned for our next video. See you guys later.